What's up guys, bringing you a little Transformers War for Cybertron. Just picked up the game a little while ago, and I gotta say, I love it. Um, I've been playing it since I got home for the last, like, s uh, five hours or so. And this game is ridiculous. I paid a little bit of the uh, campaign, a little bit of the um, multiplayer, and here I'm just kind of showing the different class systems and whatnot. We're waiting in the lobby. Uh, have a veto system. They have a challenges, kind of just similar to Call of Duty in the aspects of the challenges. Uh, you know, a certain amount of kills get you X, whatever. Um, they have a detailed leaderboards. I'm gonna show that in another video because I didn't get any footage of that really yet. So, um, you know, the game is absolutely worth picking up. Um, for anybody that has the 60 bucks, I would definitely go recommend and pick it up. Um, by far, it is one of the most fun games I've ever played. Alright, but before I get into any more with the gameplay, I just want to address uh, some things that have come up in the last week or two. Because I haven't really made a commentary just talking to you guys, because I've been doing dual commentaries lately. And I'm not going to be really doing too many more of those. Uh, I just have the commentary contest winner to um, figure out if they want to do a dual commentary or whatever it is. Uh, but that I will actually announce in my next commentary, the winner and the runner-ups. So... Um, I, I, thought, I, I thought I would do it in this video, but I haven't quite figured out the winner exactly yet because uh, there's, it, it's just confusing. So um, I'll have that on the next commentary. I'll have it all worked out. Um, but anyway, uh, if you guys know anything about Legit Gaming Union, um, I helped moderate there. And there was a recent incident where we wound up having the channel deleted by X. Well, not by accident, on purpose, from one of the moderators that we had there. Um... We were able to get the channel back, but we lost all the videos, so we've been really busy working on some stuff for it. Some of you that follow me on Facebook and Twitter, or Legit Gaming Union on Facebook and Twitter, know what we're up to. Um, for all those that don't, you just gotta, gotta wait until we launch it. So, um, you know, if you guys aren't on my Facebook or Twitter, go check it out. It's in the description below. But anyway, basically, in, in light of that whole situation, is um, another, another friend of mine... Um, well, another channel, uh, and he's a good friend of mine, and a lot of you guys actually probably came and subbed from him, uh, Bolt Action Gaming lost his channel, um, I don't really know the exact reason, something to do with YouTube, but, uh, they deleted his channel, he had over 7,000 subscribers, all lost, um, and I, I, I just want to help, help him get back to that point, because that's a lot of subscribers, and he helped me out from the get-go, when I first got my channel, he gave me a shout-out, so, you know, I just want to return the favor, and he definitely deserves it, because he had some really nice gameplay, and that would suck, so, if you guys don't know Bolt Action, or were subscribed to him, go check out his channel, it's in the description below, um, and uh, also with that, I made a backup channel just in light of anything else that might happen um, in case my channel ever gets deleted or flagged or whatever it is, um, I have a backup channel so that way I, I don't have to restart all the way back from zero. So um, if you guys appreciate my work and appreciate my commentaries and just overall like, like, my, uh, like my channel, I suggest just go subscribing to my secondary. I'm not going to be posting anything on there. And unless something happens to this channel, so you don't have to worry about like getting extra videos and whatnot. But um, yeah. So now with that pretty much out of the way, that's the majority of what I needed to relay to you guys. Now let's talk about this game. Um, I played about three or four of the campaign level uh, levels. Ah, I can't speak. Um, they are there's a uh, I think it's one to three people co-op that you can play on the campaign, which is awesome. And uh, there's like a, you can get a detailed point system for it and like, you know, or you could just play for fun and there would be no points, but it, it's so, it's a lot of fun. Um, some of the action sequences that they have, like some of the um, I, I, I cinematic videos, absolutely crazy. This game is insane. Um, campaign so far is great. Have no complaints about that. There is a kind of Nazi zombies, um, in quotation marks, kind of a... Uh, play play um playable mode uh, i have yet to do that because me and my friends we were just busy trying out the campaign and trying out the multiplayer um i'm gonna try and get some footage of it but it's basically from what i've been reading is waves after waves after waves of enemies and you just keep going kind of like nazi zombies so uh that's something that i'm really looking forward to playing uh probably tomorrow or maybe later on tonight depending on who's on um there's different game modes um uh, one's similar to capture the flag there it's like one flag ctf from uh 
Halo, not like Modern Warfare 2 where there's two flags. It, it's one flag CTF where uh, there's one defending and one attacking. Um, sadly, there is no tiebreaker round, which kind of sucks because uh, if you wind up tying, it, it's a, just a tie game. Um, but whatever, you know. No game is going to be perfect, but for the little complaints that I have about this game, I'd much rather <laughs> play this than any other game that I have in my library at this point. So, um, But there's the CTF, then there's this thing, which is King of the Hill. It's called, I think, Power Struggle. Uh, basically, the fir you could see the uh, timer thing up at the top. The first one to 400 points wins. And you can see right now my team's decimating, 213 to 34. Um, and basically, uh, you just need to control the hill. The more people you have in there, the higher the timer, uh, well, the more points you get uh, per second, I guess. I think it's per second or maybe per five seconds. Um, and, you know, if you have somebody in the hill, uh, like of the other team, it's contested. And uh, then they have regular team deathmatch. They have a domination mode, which is pretty much a domination. Um, and then they have, uh, they have one more that's kind of strange uh you have to plant the bomb there's like a neutral bomb and then you have to plant it um i guess it's like sabotage but if sabotage had three three plants rather than one and it is an all-out war um all these game modes you can you see me just diving right into the action um it's absolutely crazy uh i gotta say the kill streaks because in the demo um, if any of you watched the demo that uh, gameplay uh, commentary that I put up, the demo you didn't have uh, kill streaks. Now in this, in the real game, there are kill streaks, and each class has its own specific kill streaks. Uh, the leader, which is the class that I'm using here, has a uh, um, what is the kill streaks? There's one I forget what the th oh um, the first one at three kills. Uh, everybody's abilities come up a lot faster, and the abilities are basically like. Um, You'll see I have like a, a, a shield that I could throw out in front of me to protect me from enemies. There's also a power boost that like you'll see like kind of like a, uh, I don't know, a swirling energy thing around me that, that gives me a health boost. And anybody also around me, any of my teammates, um, you see it right there, the twirling thing, that, that's the uh, ability. And basically the three kill streak that the leader has is makes all yours and all your teammates cool down faster so you can use them in succession. Um, and it's very well balanced. It doesn't give you like an unlimited amount within that time, but it definitely helps in certain situations. Um, his next kill streak is a energy sword that he pulls out, and he basically has, I think, double the movement speed. Picture Marathon Lightweight Commando, uh, but in a sense where it, it doesn't last forever. It lasts, I think, maybe 20 or 30 seconds. And, um,. It, it seems to be a one-shot kill on most of the other characters. Uh, every character has their own health. So I, I haven't tested it ex out exactly. I'm going to try and go more in-depth in and give you guys some uh, tutorials and whatnot on this game. Um, but I think it's a one-shot kill pretty much. Uh, and here I actually, I think I do get the energy sword here. Yeah, I just got it. You see the kill streak down at the bottom and there you go. I pull out the energy sword and you see me running a little bit faster now. And I, I, at first I didn't know what the hell was going on because I didn't know that this um, was the kill streak. I, I didn't know that. And then I finally figured it out and I played a few games and now got it. Um, and his seventh kill streak, he lays down all these uh, mines that basically are homing mines within a certain range. Um, if somebody runs through or run, runs uh, around them, um, they'll kind of home in and explode. And I believe those kill in one hit. Um, and they're really powerful, so it's it's really go cool. But it is hard to get up to seven kill streaks. I've only or er, seven kills. Um, I've only done it once, so it, it it is hard to do. And it might get a little bit easier as the game goes along. I might get more familiar with it. Um, but just a, a quick little tip: if you do have this game, watch your ammo consumption because uh, you will run out of ammo quick. If especially if you're using the more powerful weapons, like here, I think I'm using the uh, plasma cannon or the fusion cannon. And uh, it is pretty powerful, and it runs out of ammo quick. So 12 and 6 anyway, guys. I hope you enjoyed this. I will be touching on more of this in the upcoming weeks. Um, hope you enjoyed this. If you don't have the game, go get it. And if you do have the game, send me a PM on my gamer tag. It's in the description. I'll gladly play with you because not all my friends have this. So uh, until next time, guys, peace out.